So what, what Sayeta um, offers uh, to our, our global clients is um, quite a few clients actually called us a, a one-stop shop um, because from the very early design concept uh, or even the market research to understand what their competitors are doing, that's pretty much where our service already can start. Um, we help our clients in positioning their product, sanity checking their product. We can, uh, we can simulate your full vehicle before even building it, uh, which is, uh, well, first of all, it saves a lot of cost because you don't have to invest into hardware. Um, several UK universities have looked at our simulation models uh, with, with Envy uh, and uh, we have proven correlation because once we have completed the simulation, we tailor the design of the motor to your needs in your specific package requirements. We can then prototype it in-house really quickly. Um, we will provide motors that you can build prototype motors and we will put them on the dyno to then test them to get as many running hours as, as quickly as possible. Um, and then very often we get extra questions of like, uh, we don't have capacity to build a prototype vehicle, we have a board presentation, we need to have a running vehicle to demonstrate it. We take on the full build in-house and we build the vehicle for you. We are in the process here in the UK of creating a pilot uh, factory for 100,000 units. Um, that will be partly European clients, uh, but it will also be pilot series for global clients uh, and a number of our own applications that we are working on. So we are a production, we can be a motor supplier, um, but we can also be a complete uh, one-stop shop uh, uh, service partner for all of your engineering needs. So my my true passion in engineering uh, that starts at a very young age is, is actually modular design. Um, so I, I, I was asked to look at Sayeta and, 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 and come and join Sayeta to run the company. And what I fell in love with immediately is the pancake shaped motor. So if you understand powertrains, um, if you have a pancake shaped motor, first of all, you get free torque because the diameter is big and the force you create is the same. It's, it's arm times force is torque. It's that simple as we all remember. Now, we have that motor and we have a, our base model at the moment is the AFT140 and uh, it produces say 15 kilowatt uh, of continuous power. And that's real power, by the way. You can run it at that power all day, every day and, and uh, it, will, it will work. Um, we are creating a smaller version and we are creating larger versions. Larger is actually easier, so we've started at the bottom of our portfolio and from here we can expand. In simple terms, um, we've created a brand new axial flux motor. Um, it's modular, it's scalable, um, we, can, we can make it work from motorbikes all the way to buses. Um, we can use it as a generator, um, we can use it for wind turbine applications. Uh, don't forget, if you turn it the other way, it becomes a very uh, efficient uh, generator. Um, modular and scalable, that's what we stand for. So the, the product portfolio of, of Sayeta, um, have, life starts pretty much at, at around uh, 8 to 9 kilowatts. Uh, very suitable for lightweight mobility. Again, that's the L3 and L7 vehicle category, motorbikes and quadricycles. But from there, we are going to expand. Um, we know that scaling the technology up makes it uh, more powerful uh, and it's actually easier. Um, so we are working, we have a number of inquiries, we're already looking at uh, bus application, vehicle applications, but that's just the physical size of one motor. The other beautiful attribute of a, a pancake uh, motor is that you can stack them. Um, so you can put a number of motors behind each other and uh, creating a modular portfolio like that. We're working on another application where effectively we are integrating the power electronics. So then you end up with a motor and the integrated inverter. Water goes in, power goes in, that's it. Um, if you put two of those together, you create a powertrain. So you could drive the left wheel with one motor, the other wheel with the other motor. We have another uh, program we're working on, which is uh, where we integrate the full motor and controller into the swing arm, which is perfect for scooter applications. And there's a lot of interest from, from Asia. Um, the next step, and that's the one I'm maybe most excited about, is if your motor looks like a wheel, maybe it's a good idea to 
put it in the wheel. And uh, we are working on in-wheel motor applications, and we're hoping to demonstrate that to the world uh, in 2021.